Hello there folks, I thought I'd record a video here since I've run a networking event tonight and not many people turned up, which is not really surprising in the wake of the coronavirus outbreak. So let me give you the benefit of my slant on things and I could well be sitting here with the virus for all I know because I haven't been tested. And here I am, uh, the lone wolf in London, uh, stupidly going on with my life and acting as though nothing is, uh, has changed at all. Uh, which some people will say is very silly of me, but I personally believe that uh, the best way to combat all of this nonsense, this fear and this squirrelling of toilet rolls is probably just to act normally, to stay positive and to keep your energy and vibration up. So here's the, uh, here's the bit that you didn't really know about me. Uh, there's a little bit of background um, where I work in energy. And one thing is for certain, um, fear reduces your immune system. So by staying positive, by staying grateful, by staying appreciative, uh, by staying in the energy of love and appreciating the good things in your life, you will actually help yourself to fight any potential viruses that could get in your body. Um, conversely, you could just join the mass panic and pray that your immune system is good enough to take the hit of what is inevitably going to be coming our way um, in a, on a bigger level and a bigger scale. So to my friends out there that have been sending me all these funny memes, keep that going because laughter has really kept me going throughout this uh, last couple of months. And uh, for anybody that's there in fear that stockpiling toilet paper, uh, well, at the very least, I would suggest is that you start adding a little bit of food to your stockpiles as well, because toilet paper doesn't taste very nice. <laughs> so on that note, I shall wish you well and wish you a virus-free week.